everyone welcome back to my channel so today I want to show you to go from this to this to this and I really hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to comment and subscribe let's go ahead and get started so I'm going to be using the new hot tool from Bellamy I'm going to be doing my hair I already went ahead and I applied my extensions I will link all my videos on how I apply my extensions down below for you guys if you guys are interested. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and turn on my hot tool and I am going to put it to the hottest setting. I like doing it but you don't have to. I just I'm so used to it because it's a, a lot faster for me to do my hair especially when I have extensions on and I have a lot of hair. I like to do it quickly. So after that, I usually section, but I wanted to see the difference between not sectioning my hair and sectioning my hair. So one side I will be sectioning my hair and on the other side I will just do without sectioning it. So on this side, I'm not going to section my hair and just do it. See how fast I can do it and how it turns out. So I'm going to show you guys a few, um, decide how I do it. And then on the other side, we'll go ahead and fast forward because it's kind of repetitive. I just wanted you guys to see me do my hair. So I do count to 10 and then I release and then move on to the next section. Um, I like to do it with a little curve on top instead of doing it on the bottom. I do try it the other way, but I, I mean, it looks the same, but I just kind of like it with a little uh, bump on the top if you guys can see that. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. So I normally just count to 10 and then I release and then move on to the next section. So that's what I'm going to basically be doing to all my hair. Um, so I'm going to let you guys watch a little bit. And if I do something different, I will let you guys know. Basically, I'm just going to crump my hair um, and then just toss it to the other side. So once I'm done, I throw it back and then move on to the next section. And yes, my hair is there. It's short. So I do like to use the hot tool on my hair so that it kind of blends into my extension so you won't be able to see where my short hair is at and where the extensions are. So this will just help to blend everything together. A little bit about this hot tool. It has a negative ion generator, eliminates static from the smooth for smooth and frizz free waves. It does have a ceramic coated plate. It ensures safe and heat distribution. It has an LCD digital display, ensures the temperature, the setting goes up to 450. And then it has a deep single barrel, the one that I'm telling you guys that I like to have on top. It creates sculpt waves with the ease. And then it does have the safety shut off, automatically shuts off after one hour. So for us that forget to turn off our heat waves are strain irons are curlers this will turn off if you don't touch it for an hour so that's amazing and then it has that gold eight feet swivel cord for it's like flexible it has a 360 i love it because it has the little thing that it'll move um it's called the maneuverability something like that it moves so it doesn't get stuck and you don't have to kind of be moving around it just follows so yeah and it's so easy to use you guys like it's so easy you just choose whatever side you like the most like I said I do like the um, the deep single barrel to be on top I don't know I just feel like it gives me more of a volume so yeah so I'm gonna finish up doing the last pieces like I said I didn't section this hair really good just because I wanted to see if it'll still give me the same um, thing at the end and it definitely does it doesn't matter which side you use so there's no right or wrong way to use it I feel like it's easy to use you can just choose whatever side you like so I'm just finishing up here and I'm gonna let you guys watch a little bit more and yeah I will list all the products down below uh, everything I use I did use a heat protection on my hair as well I just didn't film it and like I said I'll film whatever I will list whatever extensions I use and all the products I used in my hair down below for you guys. Alright, so for this part I did um, 
section it just because the top part does have most of my hair so I kind of wanted to make sure that I did that part right because that part is what's going to show um, so I'm just finishing up this little piece from here and then I'm gonna go ahead and move on with the top part the top part is very important to me because it is what's going to make the whole look look good you know um, so I like that this hot tool doesn't give me these crazy waves that I won't be able to fix it so I'm gonna show you guys what I mean so as you guys can see the top of my head when I um, do the hot tool as you guys can see I'm using the other side just to try it out see what, what differences does it give me and honestly it just looks really nice it looks the same so I just went back and used the same one but as you guys can see it doesn't give me that big hump that I've seen because I've used other tools and they give me a big weird hump at the crown of my head and it just doesn't look right so this one doesn't give you that and I love that because I can keep my hair parted in the middle and I won't look funny because with other tools that I've used it does look weird that you have to part your hair to the side to make the hairstyle look good once you crumped your hair with the hot tool so this hot tool doesn't give you that weird hump that's what I liked about it you guys will see at the end how amazing my hair looks with this or this amazing hot tool guys I love it so like I said I'll list everything down below if you guys are interested in checking it out um, any discount codes I can get for you guys I will I don't have a discount code for this I will ask to see if they can give me a discount code for you guys but I don't have a discount code so but any discount codes anything that I can find I will list it down below for you guys All right, if you got into this far with me, I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. And this is the final look. I really love how these waves came out. They look amazing. I love it. Definitely check it out. I'll link it down below for you guys. I want to thank you guys again for watching. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Don't forget to leave me a comment. Please give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys so much. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.